What up, YouTube? This is John Snow speaking from John Snow Sports and Fitness, and today I'm going to talk about a very popular subject. Wait for it. Fat loss. Okay. Now, I've been getting this question a lot lately, and people have been asking me, they said, John, what's the fastest way to lose fat? I don't like having a gut. I'm starting to hate myself. I need help. What's the fastest way to lose fat? Okay. Disregard the mocking, but... I do it because I just get so sick of hearing it. No, but anyway, this is what you do, guys, and it's extremely simple. First thing you need to do to lose fat is change your diet. Change your diet. If your diet's not working, Cut your calories back more. If you're lazy, don't eat carbs. If you don't want to work out, don't eat carbs. If you want to do it the easier way, do the If It Fits Your Macros meal plan. Just basically, you eat anything you want and you track your calories but you don't go overboard you stay in a calorie deficit which is the number one way to lose fat is to be in a caloric deficit calorie deficit guys remember that folks calorie deficit that includes women too ladies if you want to lose fat what do you have to be in a caloric deficit. <laughs> you got it? Okay. Now, here are some workout strategies to cut fat. Remember this. Folks, get, get out a piece of paper and a pencil. You might want to write these down. These. <laughs> these are the goods right here. So pay attention. Sit down and shut up because playtime's over. This is what it takes. To lose fat, this is how you have to work out. When you're at the gym lifting weights, do your same workout. Basic, basically, if you're doing compound movements, you're doing it right. But this is what you do. Cut the rest periods in half. Most of you folks that want to lose weight, you, you rest too long between sets. Cut that time in half, and you'll see you're spending about 45 minutes in the gym if you do it right. What I mean by this, if you're doing four sets of squats, take 30 seconds rest in between. Four sets of deadlifts, take 30 seconds rest in between. Now, it's going to bruise your ego a little bit. You're not going to be pushing as much weight, but you know what? Suck it up, because your goal is fat loss. Your goal is fat loss, so you got to suck it up. you got to tough it out. Yeah, so that's what you do. You do bench presses, same thing, 30 second rest, period, rest periods. If you do that for a month, two months, and your diet's good and you don't lose fat, then you need to see a doctor because your hormones are imbalanced and you're not normal. If you do that and you eat a good diet, I guarantee you, I guarantee you'll lose fat. And if you don't lose fat, you did something wrong. You got it? <laughs> also, what you can do, this is easy. Better yet, let me say, this is simple. But folks don't want to do it because it's hard. Oh, it's hard. I might get injured. It's hard. I don't want to do it. No, too bad. Listen, another fat loss strategy is to sprint. Sprint. Yeah, I said it. Sprint. I didn't say do long, slow cardio. Sprint. Go on a football field 
a track, a baseball field, outside, I don't care. In the middle of the street, your girlfriend's house, it does not matter. But this is what you do. You sprint. You do a warm-up, a 10-minute warm-up, dynamic warm-up. If you don't know what a dynamic warm-up is, I'll make a video on that later. Basically, a dynamic warm-up is something you do to get your heart rate going. It's light but active, an active warm-up. And then you sprint. If you're fat, you do five. If you're slightly fat, you do ten. And if you have one layer of body fat left, you do twelve to fifteen sprints. You do this, and you lift weights, and do my method, you will lose fat. You understand me? This is Jon Snow speaking from Jon Snow Sports and Fitness. Subscribe to the channel for the latest sports updates, sports analysis, sports advice, fitness advice, fitness advice for athletes, and anything related to sports and fitness. This is Jon Snow speaking. Peace out.